Hey church family, it's Tuesday morning before Thanksgiving. I'm cozy here in my office watching these fat snowflakes swirl uh, down and I just thought it'd be fun to do a little uh, trailer, a little teaser for our upcoming Advent series. Uh, John Lennon, the famous songwriter from the Beatles, has this incredible quote. He says, there are two basic motivating forces in life, fear and love. When we're afraid, we pull back from life. When we are in love, we are open to all that life has to offer with passion, excitement, and acceptance. All hopes for a better world rest in the fearlessness and open-hearted vision of people who embrace life. I think that's beautiful. And to quote another, perhaps slightly less eccentric John, John the Apostle, uh, the John for whom my son is named after, uh, 1 John 4.18 says, There is no fear in love, but perfect love casts out fear. For fear has to do with punishment. Whoever fears has not been perfected in love. We love because he first loved us. And we are beginning our Advent series this Sunday, and we're calling this series Fear Not. And we're going to look at this really profound connection, this profound pattern uh, between the proclamation of the birth of Jesus we see in Scripture and this call to do not be afraid or to fear not. As it turns out, Jesus is to fear what light is to darkness. As Jesus comes onto the scene, fears are revealed, they're exposed, and then they're met with the grace of God. And here's the kicker, folks, that the fears that we see addressed uh, around the birth of Christ in Scripture are for all fears that you and I uh, deal with all the time. And in all the fear of 2020, I'm praying that we'll be able to receive God's love, uh, perfect love that casts out fear as we celebrate the birth of our King Jesus. So that's it. That's the teaser for Advent series that we're kicking off this Sunday. There's two ways for you to join us. Uh, either the live stream posted to Facebook or YouTube. I know a lot of you uh, are quarantined uh, in this crazy time, so we're committed to keeping our live stream going and making it as good as we possibly can. Uh, and, or you can join us in person. Uh, providentially, we've been blessed with a super cool building uh, that we can meet in uh, at a safe distance and wear masks and all that stuff. Uh, so you can join us at 1535 Cambridge Drive Southeast, or if you just look up Redemption Church in uh, Google Maps, uh, you should find us there on the south. East End. But in order to uh, be as safe as possible, we're asking folks to register for a Sunday gathering. Uh, make sure that we're at that 20% uh, capacity and we can spread out and everything. You can go to our website, redemptiongr.org, and just click the, the button to register for the Sunday gathering. And you can also put your info in there for contact tracing so that we'll uh, just do everything we can to stay as safe as possible, but also just provide an avenue for people to connect uh, if they're able to. But that's all for now, fam. I hope you have a really great Thanksgiving, uh, that it's sweet and safe, and that you're able to enjoy just expressing gratitude for all the ways that God uh, is with you and has blessed you even in the midst of a, of a crazy year. Uh, because we know, uh, without a doubt, uh, in the immovable goodness of God, on the, of seeing Jesus on the cross, that his goodness and mercy follows us all the days of our life. Grace and peace to you. I'll see you Sunday.